The Energy Cube Challenge is you have one month, the month of May. You have to make the most energy cubes with your school. What we do is uh, we try to get the school moving for a whole month, but just not the school, it's the whole community. A cube is when you do 15 minutes of sports or activities. That's basically at home, at school. Like about four times a day. Uh, you receive all the information from the organization. It's a really easy thing to plan. Everybody that's watching this, it's really fun. <laughs> My students, they will uh, organize the whole thing. All I have to do is supervise. To get our cubes, like we do a lot of activities together. Um, my favorite sport is hockey. Uh, badminton and the mini hockey. Hip hop, ski racing, ballet. We push the chair, we dance, we uh, do some exercise. The cubes like these, that they roll, and it tells them how many of which activity to do. Every time I run 15 minutes, just a cube appears. <laughs> if your family moves with you, then they give you an extra cube. So let's say you do half an hour. If you did it yourself, you would only get two cubes. But if you did it like with a member of your family, you would get four cubes. My son comes back with all the information and everything. It's a good opportunity to spend quality time together. And I think that, uh, that well, all my family could do it. The more you get cubes, the more chances you'll have to win something for your school. Yeah, the big prize is awesome. It's like you go to Stanley Peak, you get to see a bunch of concerts, you go to La Ronde, you sleep at the Stanley Peak, which would be awesome. It helps kids get moving. Like, it's not only collecting cubes, it's also having fun. You can do it for fun and to be healthy. So before an exam, sometimes we will stand up and move together. It does make a big difference into their ability to concentrate and to perform also. It gets my mind on other things. Just bring everyone closer, honestly. And we can have fun with our students. I would inspire you all to do it if you could. I find that the students who come back from it work better because they have all their jumpies out. The parents should do it too. It helps me uh, concentrate to do exercise. Some teachers or parents are telling me, well, you lose 15 minutes of teaching and I always say that I gain 30 minutes of not having to discipline in my class and things like that. Keep getting more energy cubes every day. Do it with your family. Every school should have time to get out and move not only when it's the energy cubes, also when it's like recess, um, get out there, play champ, run. So every school should have some time to do some physical exercise every day.